What is going on guys my name is Mehul and welcome to your 8th TypeScript tutorial in which I'm gonna show you some functions writing in TypeScript. So in TypeScript what we need to do is that it makes a bit of coding easier with functions. So in vanilla.js what I would do to add two numbers is just return a plus b and I would have passed a and b here. With TypeScript, what you can do instead is that you can explicitly check if these numbers are actually just numbers and uh, you can actually specify the return type as well. So let's just create a simple function. So let's just say this function just add nums and right here num1. I want this to be a number data type. I just make some room for it. And the next, second one would be num2 and this would be a number data type as well. And what I want this function as a whole to return data as the data type of the return is a number. Because obviously when you add two numbers you will get a number. And I want to return num1 plus num2. All right, now if I just console log add nums 10, 20, and I compile this code. As you can see, it's compiled successfully into this code. But if I add something like this and build it again, you can see that it shows me an error. So what I can do is I can just switch this num1 to any and I can say that if num or if type of num1 equals string then num or if is not a number parse parsint num1 to the base 10 return 0 else num1 is parsint num1 to the base 10 well that's some simple javascript code out there and this should probably make our code work as well scanner file this should be inside the quotes so that is why you know TypeScript is useful and yeah so that's how it works so if I reload this as you can see we get 30 as the answer which is right and that's pretty much how you would get started with functions in TypeScript and in the future tutorials we'll be covering more about this and yeah, so that's all for this one and don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching.